G'day, g'day. Welcome back to another dev vlog. Um, we have made some major, major, major changes since... Was it last week when I uploaded the last dev vlog? Can't remember. I'm trying to do these weekly, but I'm not too sure if it was last week or the week prior. What I remember is I'm getting a little bit, you know, mixed up with all these. But yeah, so we've made some major changes. We've effectively... I say we, but, you know, stuff's a little bit mixed up so we had chris who ended up last weekend effectively remaking the whole game from the ground up um and then some things we've decided to keep some things not then we've just been reworking everything back off there so we've done some pretty big stuff though um we've got level one um which is nice i ignore these these are all um oh what would you call them Temporary things for us so we can see. What's up? Level selection. We've added level selection. And I've taken some pretty nice inspiration from some stuff, which I will go over. Level 2, which is incompletable, but is helpful. Then we got controls, which doesn't currently exist per se, but is fine. Um Let me see if I can bring up. We do have a controls thing, we just haven't actually imported it yet there's a couple things that i'm just going to have on the side now just why um can explain some stuff so just running through what the game is like currently um nice made with game maker starts in full screen now i think everything still works in terms of resizing keeps the aspect ratio yep but um yep so it's nice starts off thank you aub oops sorry this seemed to apparently take a bit too Set up. But yeah, thank you AU for getting the title screen out. We've got some awesome, awesome, awesome work from um, Ruben, um, who with me does some awesome artwork. So let me see. He made a really awesome starting title screen. So um, looking really, really good. So look forward to having that put in there. Um, not sure how we're gonna do if that's gonna be like come up first or if it's gonna be um just the background and we'll put these some other place not sure i don't think we have a decision maybe put it over there not too sure um i don't think we've really talked about that yet but regardless that looks awesome can't wait to get that in there um and the main title um like title screen looks sick you know you've obviously got clip which does work um not too sure why it takes a minute to show um regardless um controls doesn't show anything at the moment um play does work awesome uh transition i think that was either aub or remy i can't remember who did that i think that was um remy um then remy's been working on a level selection screen which I think he's done an awesome job with. Um, <laughs> you shoot very fast now. I'm not sure if we're going to change that or... Uh, I'm not too sure in regards to that. But um, we've also got coins. Thank you, Chris. Um, so this is sort of an idea that I had for the game for a while. And I hadn't really decided... You know, I kind of ran, ran it with the rest of the team. I don't know if you guys have played Melatonin. But if you played Melatonin, they have a nice level selection screen. Let me see if I have a... Here we go. My dev vlog that we've gotten. We kind of ran up. I don't know if I talked about this last dev vlog, but having, like, you know, a selection in this regard, or go Mario, where you just, like, move by pressing the arrow keys or whatever, and it moves you to the next level. Or you go melatonin, which is fully um, interactable, and you move to each section and stuff. So we decided to take inspiration heavily from melatonin in that regard. Um, so now, uh, to select your levels, these three, we don't have extra levels for these at the moment. So those will just break the game. Or well, I'm not sure if it fully breaks it, but you can choose. I'm pretty sure you can go straight in. Um yeah so if i press pause thank you yeah, yeah for a nice pause menu everything actually works the way that i was envisioning in that regard um oh yeah it's not e we had for a temporary 
uh, E to pick up, but now we don't. So pause, you know, it stops everything, it works as intended. Nice, um, you know, how it darkens everything and whatnot. Really draws your attention to everything. So pause, you can go back to the menu. Um, but yeah, you can push it. So it's very nice. You press space and it pushes the blocks. I'm not sure if we're going to... I think we'll change out the blocks, but I'm not sure if we're going to keep this design or not. I think we're weighing the um, things. Um, but I'm very happy with it, where it's looking. Um, oops. Push it into here. So selling first level, you know, push it there. It, it's pretty obvious there's only one thing to do. We're going to have text that explains everything as well. Um, opens this. Um, which I've done a, I quite like the uh, animation we've done with it. Um, brings you to this level selection. You can go see the next one. Um, where, bam. Um, so we have a bit, a lot of stuff. As you can see, there's some things missing. Some things a bit changed. So um, we've kind of changed up the bricks again to be pretty top-down bricks. But uh, um, I, I think interesting they changed that i didn't know that they changed that before it was just um you know there was no way to finish but that's interesting i do really like the transitions that we've done though um i think i think it was remy i can't remember i don't want to say who it was in particular i think it was either remy or au but i can't remember exactly um but yeah so it looks awesome i think um how do we there we go. Still, I wasn't scrolling up. So we're working on some new levels. Ruben had been plotting up some new levels, which we've been running into some issues with Game Maker and the way that you can share projects. So um, we currently use Fork. I explained that last time, but then having to share different levels breaks everything. It's so annoying. So new levels is kind of going to be something that is going to be added on the side. Probably in the last like two weeks where we might all try push levels and stuff and each have a couple of days to come up with a couple different levels or something. I'm not too sure, but I think we've got three or four more weeks to work on this and it's coming along really well. Um, there's a couple of things that haven't been implemented. Um, Ruben's been working on a damage system. So you still take damage. Um, the character that's not like physically the character going to be taking damage but um i kind of gave him the basis of wolfenstein or doom um in the older games as you take damage the it's got the main character's face and he still gets like looks more beat up and stuff so um i kind of left ruben with that just you know what can you come up with that and he's done a pretty good job with it i quite like it so over time he's slowly um I guess curls up a bit um and you know he slowly takes turns more red and red and red indicating um you know bleeding and shit so i really like how that's been going um ruben's done a very good job with that there was my wall breaking nothing too important we've got a uh, seed so we're gonna be turning the bullets a lot of these assets haven't been implemented but i got a seed which is small eight by eight um that i've worked on for like the bullet um mummy sleepwalk i animated oh this is just the um sprite sheet for it which we also haven't added but i um animated it so i've got a, a cool walking um animation here so it's like uh i don't think i can show exactly with that but it's mummy animated so if i go that's him dying, I guess. Um, you can just see, you know, like the he he doesn't die, but he gets like deactivated temporarily, and his arms just droop down, which I quite like. Um, and then what else? We can go one to three. Then the walk animation. He just his arms are bobbing up and down. Don't move the feet or anything, but pretty happy with that i think the main character also i animated the main character we've at some point gotten rid of the main character movement but that'll be brought back i think by next week um because there's these and a couple other things that i've been working on let's see what other 
things. We've got nice control screen that I made. It was by breaking of the walls. Uh, we got a couple of things, coins and some other stuff that is not important. So, yeah, we've made some really good progress. Full remake, and I'm pretty happy with all of our work, to be honest. Ruben's been doing some awesome artwork. I've been pumping out some just a heap of artwork myself. Um, you know, you got AU who's been doing some awesome work with getting the menus and the pause and everything else working, helping us fix or fork and stuff because we're running into issues. And then, you know, Remy's been doing an awesome job getting the level selection working and just, you know, filling in the gaps while Chris has just been re touching up stuff, you know, implementing new things like the coins. He pumped that out in like 30 minutes, which is quite impressive. So we're doing uh, really, really good, making some very awesome progress and yeah um what are we looking for next week i want like it's a tricky one eh um i think next week i'm gonna be reworking some art with ruben hopefully getting some new levels if we can spare some time for those um not too sure maybe at least getting five levels um to fit the five um we want to have the menu fully up and going maybe with ruben's uh, awesome title screen um controls and um hopefully all the animations and stuff working potentially we're going to rework the coins we weren't too sure that's like a temporary we might have emeralds or something like that um so that's going to be played with a little bit but at the moment everything's being played with we still have a couple more weeks to go um it's going to be a pretty tight squeeze but we'll be Good. I think we're pretty good in comparison to a lot of um, the other teams at the moment um, in terms of how much work we've completed, I think. So, like, I think out of all the teams, our game is most fundamentally complete in terms of you can play our game to the end and you're not going to run into really any issues. And, um, sorry about that. Um, and yes, I think I would, I'm very happy with ours. Um, all the other teams have been doing awesome work as well. I'm liking a lot of the artwork. It's really funny. Uh, oddly enough, we got Ruben and myself. We're not 3D. Uh, we're 3D artists. We're not 2D artists. So I think we're doing a pretty good job. Chris and Remy are sometimes helping out. Um, very helpful. Uh, you know, Chris made some nice mummies and Remy's been making some cool blocks and stuff. So uh, filling in the gaps for when Ruben and I are just like completely stumped. But um I think we've made really good progress in. Well, the other teams seem pretty good. Um, but I'm thoroughly happy with our team in particular, of course. So, yeah. Um, I guess thank you for watching. Um, just once again, let me know if there's anything you guys want to see. Any suggestions you have. Um, you know. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm open and happy for everything. And I'm just very happy seeing where we are currently. And I honestly think... You know, I would be happy if we just pumped out a bunch of levels and this was it. I'm really happy with how it looks at the moment. Um, but, you know what I mean? It's going to look even better once we finish and finalise it. So, we'll see where things go. I'm going to start struggling because me being the, I guess, somewhat team leader. Not necessarily by choice, but by uh, how, how things went. Um, I'm going to be struggling to come up with new things for us to add. I have a couple of things on hand that I think we could be improving and implementing and adding, but, uh, you know, I'm running dry soon, so we'll see. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys all for watching. Feel free to add anything and we'll catch you hopefully next weekend. i sorry this is later, but then I was, like, you know, going to upload something on Thursday and I'm like, yeah, no, I think Friday we're going to have some big work and there's a lot of stuff that I want done on Friday. So I guess expect these to be coming out on the weekends or maybe early week after the weekend if I'm too busy in the weekends. Um, but it will be about at least, uh, at most, I mean, once a week. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and catch you next time. See ya.